top 10 ghosts caught on camera. Thing in the road. The Chapali Toll Road in West Java, Indonesia is known for two things. Frequent traffic accidents and reports of strange supernatural sightings along the roadway. This bizarre dash cam footage almost captures both. The video, which was recorded just after midnight, is bizarre enough even at normal speed, but slowed down, it becomes downright terrifying. Some strange misshapen thing appears to be simply standing in the middle of the road. Locals believe this to be a ghost caught on camera, but what do you think? The Silmar Ghost Parent Anna Diano was attending a high school football game at Silmar High School in Los Angeles, California. She was recording her daughter Mariella doing a cheerleading routine when she caught this strange footage. <laughs> Students at the school have started to refer to the footage as the Silmar Ghost. What do you think? It don't look photoshopped, it looks real as real can be. CBS2 News in Los Angeles asked Anna's daughter if the cell footage had been edited. So she, she doesn't even know how to work her phone, so no. So is this a bizarre phone glitch or a ghost caught on camera? You decide. The Ghost of Carmel, Maine. Hello and welcome to Ghost of Carmel, Maine. In a previous video about ghosts and shadow people, I've talked about Kent Burris and his channel, The Ghosts of Carmel, Maine. Ghosts of Carmel. A man named Kent says that he began to experience strange occurrences after moving into his house in Carmel, Maine. He found that his house had once been owned by an undertaker and that the residence served as a funeral home from the years 1906 to 1919. Kent claims that his house is very supernaturally active and is haunted by multiple ghosts and strange beings. Well, Okay, there he is, in the window again. Went under the bed. If you're wondering why Kent's reaction is so casual in a situation that would absolutely horrify most of us, well, he says he's had hundreds of these bizarre encounters while living in his haunted home. Hope you guys say something or do something. Oh my god! No! Uh oh. To see all of Kent's ghost investigations and more of his terrifying paranormal footage, I highly recommend checking out his YouTube channel. Ghosts of Carmel, Maine. The Night Visitor. Twitter user Cheyenne Rachel posted that her dad claimed that when he slept at night, he felt like something was messing with his sheets and that he sometimes got the eerie impression that someone was sitting on his bed. He set up a camera to record overnight and this is what he caught. It actually looks like someone sits up in the bed and then just kind of sinks down into the sheets. But is it just the bed covers moving in a bizarre way or something paranormal? And why does this look like a head that just seems to disappear? Exploring the Asylum On the Urban Exploration Channel Exploring with Mikhail, they explore the old abandoned South Carolina mental asylum. 
Built in 1820, this building was one of the first mental hospitals in the U.S. It goes without saying that the old asylum has a long, dark history. Mikhail and her friends are walking along the third floor of the creepy hospital when she hears an odd noise coming from one of the old patient restrooms. I thought I was <laughs> This is the main floor. Oh, look at that. Now, you might wonder why the video abruptly cuts out right after the strange incident with the blinds. And so did I. So I asked Mikhail if there was more footage and she explained that bizarrely, the camera on her phone just froze right after the incident. Now, at first that might seem a bit suspicious, but Mikhail was nice enough to even send me a screen cap of the raw video from her phone to prove the strange lockup. Oh, look at that. So is this a ghost caught on camera? Or is it just the wind doing some very bizarre things with the blinds? And a glitchy phone. The Sad Observer. This next clip was a private video uploaded to YouTube six years ago. A man named Oscar and his family were out having a fun day at a nearby creek. When they checked their footage back, it turned out they were not alone. The pale image of a little girl in white can be seen sadly watching them from the creek's edge. Oscar claims that there was no little girl there when they filmed the original video. At least, not that they could see. A Walk in the Woods This next video was sent in to me by a viewer. He says that the video was recorded by his brother Carlos who would often film himself on hiking treks through the forest of El Mascal, a rural area of Barcelona, Spain. This video was recorded in 2016. Carlos has not gone on a nighttime hike ever since.
so what do you think is this a paranormal encounter or a ghost caught on camera or is it all just an elaborate hoax you decide runner a man and his wife move to a new house in the wilderness in Bradford Pennsylvania he decides to record a video to send back to his family in California to show them their new place but he catches something that he didn't expect. And we're walking. <laughs> no more holding her purse. <laughs> Ooh, what is that in the tree way up there? A lion. Look. Where? The dark part of it up there. Dark? Did you see it? No. You better tell me before we get too close. Right up there. And up? Yeah, way at the very top. You're tripping. Point it out with the camera. Oh, no oh it's mind. just part of the tree then. Okay, then stop trying to freak people out and follow me. Hold on. Is that it? Yeah. There's the bonfire. Pool. I just saw something run across the screen. Liar. What about it? Who stopped this? I don't know, Ben. No, it was like a, it was like a shadow. How do I stop this? A strange mist that almost looks like running legs comes out of nowhere and disappears behind a bush. Is this something paranormal or just some bizarre natural phenomenon? Deja vu. Two guys on a motorcycle are riding along a lonely back road toward the city of Uti, India when they spot something a bit strange along the road. The riders are speaking the language Tamil, but you don't really need to understand their words to hear just how freaked out they are. As they continue down the road, they calm down a bit, but then this. And there the video just sort of cuts out. Now some viewers think that the writer's terrified reactions make the video seem very real. But what do you think? How would you react to repeatedly seeing this on the road? Footsteps. Popular French YouTuber GooseDX does a very creepy paranormal and ghost hunting series called Chasseur de Fantôme, which in English simply translates to Ghost Hunter. In the series, he travels around to remote locations in France to investigate reports of haunted locations and paranormal activity. In this episode, Gusti X spends the night in a haunted house where the owners describe multiple disturbing occurrences. Water puddles in the floor, even though there is no rain or leaks. Things go missing around the house only to show up later in odd locations. But the late night sounds are the most disturbing of all. Doors can be heard opening and closing on their own. Strange voices call out in the night and loud footsteps can be heard pacing the halls and clambering up the attic steps. Gusti X spends the night in a bedroom right beside the attic stairs.
quelqu'un. Je vous entends marcher. After hearing loud footsteps on the attic stairs, Ustiex opens the door to find nothing. He checks, but no one is in the house. When he climbs the stairs, he finds that the attic light is on, even though that he's certain that he turned all the lights off before bed. Ustiex has no idea what caused the loud footsteps on the stairs. So, if you speak a little French, you can check out the rest of the ghost hunting series over on the YouTube channel, GoostDX. Thanks for watching, be sure to follow me on Twitter at NukesTop5, and if you want to suggest a video for inclusion in the Top 5, hit me up on Facebook at facebook.com slash NukesTop5, and hit the send message button.